Assalamu alaikum. It's another weekend, another road trip. It's really beautiful out here and it just makes you kind of reflect on your life that Allah gave you life. After he gave you death, you were nothing. And now you can experience these things, go on top of the hills, see the beautiful views. Like this is what life is about. You experience things that if you didn't have life, you wouldn't. And so I guess the point is that just having life is awesome, whatever version. What's so special about life, right? Just the ability to have it, the ability to live, to experience, to smell, to walk. Look where I am. This is so beautiful. There's nobody here. What a crazy place. Anyways, yeah. You were dead. You were nothing. You didn't exist. There was not even a potential for you to exist. I mean, if we're using deterministic principles, yes, everything was determined. But you didn't exist some at some point in time. And then, out of nothing, you begin. You were a sperm, and then there was an egg. And somehow, I don't know how, they created you. And then you went on to be, to grow up, and to think that you own your life. Which is such a crazy thought. Like, how can you own something if you don't even know who gave it to you? Like... Did you create yourself? That's when you would actually own your life. Like if you would be able to create life, that's how you could claim that, yes, I own my body and my life and everything. But you didn't do anything to deserve to live. And yes, there's in life you have bad moments and evil things. There's a reason for that. And also you have good things. And so, but it's irrelevant just to experience life, just to have it, even the worst version, homeless person, somebody disabled, it's still, it's still better than not to have life. Because you have the ability to get to know things, to experience this dunya. Like, think about that, like, you were nothing, you were dead, then you, be, you were alive. Then you will die again, and then again Allah will give you life, and He will resurrect you. And then, we all know the, the drill, <laughs> well, we don't, but we, we know we will be judged and either Jannah or Jahanna. Anyways, that's the, that's the thing. And so, people say like, hey, when you die, how can you believe you will be resurrected? Dude, you didn't exist, and you have life. So Allah created life for you from nothing, from sperm, nothing, and now you exist. So he already did it once. How he's gonna do it twice, I don't know. But I don't think it's a big problem for him. I don't think we have to, we really realize like how crazy it is that you can even like have your hands and you know, just touch things like you can with you, the will of your mind, with your thoughts, you can influence whatever you want in this dunya. Now, of course, the further society and everything like that, but I'm talking about just your body, just the ability to grab, to speak out, and then other people understanding what you mean. Like, how crazy is that on some basic, fundamental level sort of deal? That's insane. So, be grateful for that. Otherwise, you will think you own life and you will be ungrateful. And we all know what happens to those people. Anyways, Salaam Alaikum.